Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Girly. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you guys are all great. I hope you're keeping safe in these current times. Today's video, as you can tell, is about the fact that I got my braces off. Yay! <laughs> yeah guys, anyone who knows me knows it's, it's been time for them to come off. It's been a minute. Yeah, finally got them off. I'm so excited. I feel like I'm not focused enough. What 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 is going on? What's what's happening? Better? I think that's better. Okay. So I finally got my races off. I'm super excited. I'm not like all the way happy with how my teeth turned out, but I'll take what I can get at this point. I just wanna be done and I'm done. So exciting time. So, let's jump right into it. Um, so I made a list of like all the things that people usually ask me when I had braces. And some of the questions are also from you guys. Like I ran a quick Q&A on my Instagram page. So I'll answer those at the very, very end. But yeah, let's get into it. Um, the first question is usually, why did I get braces? Especially people who knew me before because they didn't think my teeth were that bad. My teeth were... Yeah. They were doing something and it wasn't cute. Like, it wasn't cute at all. Because I feel like I'm not... I'm not focused enough. Maybe I need to like increase... I don't know. I'm trying. Okay. I've, I've tried my very best. I don't know. But yeah, like I was saying. My teeth were doing something and whatever they were doing was not cute and they needed to stop. So, uh, my front teeth used to like do this, you know, they were like, they were these niggas, they would like chill like this. So, like, so I had to handle that, that was the biggest thing. But turns out there were other things that I didn't know about, like the fact that my jaw was not aligned, the fact that there was a tooth that was missing that later grew, so we needed to make space for it. So had I not gotten braces, that tooth now about lamuting and caused more problems. So yeah, we just discovered, you know when you think you're going in for the flu and then you come out with like a million other things, that's what happened to me. But yeah, that is why I got my braces. I had my braces for 10 long years like I got them in 2010 I got them at the beginning of yeah the beginning of 2010 so it's been 10 years can I use it my menu is what's all I love to say <laughs> love they love to say that but yeah it was 10 years a very very long 10 years I like I have nieces and nephews who don't know me without braces and they're adult like okay they're not adults but like they're humans now they're not babies like they're humans that's how long I've had them okay price so um the thing about braces is the price is split, like the cost is split between you and your medical aid and it depends on your medical aid how much they pay I use Balmade I'm not quite sure how much they paid but I know it was a larger portion than what we paid I think but bear in mind I was like a kid I didn't care too much about this part because I, I, I couldn't contribute so it was none of my business but yeah excuse me but yeah um, at the time when I got them they were 20 something thousand so I'm sure inflation and just businesses. The price has definitely gone up. Also, another thing is the price depends, like each case is different. For example, when I started, I had like something on the top of my, on the roof of my, like here. So yeah, my friends who also had braces did not get that. They got like different things. So it really just depends on your individual treatment and the severity of your teeth. That will dictate how much money you spend because of how much help your teeth need. I don't know if I'm making sense, but yeah. Basically, from that 20 something thousand, I forgot the exact figure, from that 20 something thousand, medical aid would pay that part. Um, so, okay, so let me say this. In every medical aid scheme, you have like every, 
member has a certain amount that they can use for certain things so it will pay all of your dental and orthodontics money all of your yeah all of your dental and orthodontics money will go towards paying for your braces for that year and then depending on how long you have them for that's how how much the that's how long you have to pay the bill so i was supposed to have mine for two years so medical aid paid over a span of two years right right so as for you you pay your portion every month you pay your portion every month for that two years as well so basically you finish paying in the time that they roll totally you're gonna have your braces for that long i did not have my braces for that long but when i finished but when i had get the two years i stopped paying because i had paid the full amount yes all right i think i explained everything yeah uh next part okay was i happy am i happy i was happy in the beginning with the general experience except the queuing but yeah i was pretty happy the like the service was i thought was great everything was okay and i was happy with like what was happening but now i was i the reason i got them off is because i was actually fed up i was tired of having them i was like you know what just it wasn't a thing of the doctor said to me yo your teeth are perfect they're amazing take them off i was like no i'm done take these off i'm not playing with you no more no cut the camera dead ass so yeah that's why i got my braces removed so on a scale of like one to ten i think i think i'm at like a six or a seven um it's actually it might go down a bit because i'm slightly annoyed that i haven't gotten my retainer so i feel like my teeth are gonna shift a bit so i feel like that is gonna uh, that's like my happiness is going down i was already not happy but now it's just getting worse and worse and worse so yeah but yeah right now it's at a seven they're pretty aligned they're pretty okay i think the only problem is now i have to probably get them bleached by a dentist because they're not like as white or as clean as i feel they should be i did go to the dentist for a cleaning so that helped a bit but yeah in terms of alignment i think it's as good as it's gonna get at this point unless i like change orthodontics or something because i don't think there's anything they can personally do for me anymore yeah so yeah a seven i removed them because i was tired i was tired i was tired i was not having it it was over like i was tired and i think they wanted to make me start paying again so that was what was like nah i'm out i'm out i'm out i'm out because it was a very I felt like it was a very difficult relationship to say because they wouldn't explain to me what exactly was was still wrong with my teeth but then they just kept saying oh no you're almost there you're almost there so i just felt like they were leading me on maybe had they explained oh no there's just this left maybe i would understand i would have understood but like i wasn't getting any communication so i was like you know what bye 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 Bye. So yeah, that is why I removed my braces. It was actually not like a pleasant ending because I actually had to like put up a bit of a fight because they were like, no, um, the doctor wasn't even there the day that this particular incident happened for me to decide I was done, done, done. And then yeah, I was just like, no, I'm done. I'm not doing this no more. I'm done playing with you. It's over. Nope, I'm done, done. So. So yeah, that is what happened. Um, um, the pros of getting braces is if your teeth are actually a thing that like really hurts your self-esteem or like you have insecurities about your teeth, definitely fixing them will help. Definitely. Um, what else is a pro? I don't know oh okay um you're more aware of taking care of your teeth i think because the first few months or years is like very weird because things get stuck in them so you have to like be more cautious of that you have to be more cautious of how you eat and stuff like that be more careful yeah so it does teach you how to have better dental hygiene um i thought my dental hygiene was pretty great 
turns out i was wrong so it really need, like having braces really needs you to go above and beyond because i would I, I would like brush twice a day i would like you know make sure i don't have tea, food in my teeth i would use mouthwash but yeah it still wasn't enough so clearly having braces is like really high maintenance so if you're trying to learn how if you're trying to like take better care of your teeth this is one way to learn but i guess that's also a con because it's so high maintenance like it's so you, you can't eat certain things we oh, like okay what's the word what type of, no that's not the word you can't like you're always like aware of how you're eating and you say you can't just eat well obviously towards the end i just got used to it who it's hot hold on let me open a window yeah uh like i was saying um towards the end i obviously got a little better at taking care of my teeth but yeah it does it does take a little a lot of effort it's very high means so another con is the fact that they're quite expensive so if you guys can't like if you as, as like a grown-up or your family cannot afford them i would take a pass it's an unnecessary burden sorry i'm trying to see if my powder has flashback <laughs> anyway yeah it's not like it's not emerge it's not an emergent thing unless like your teeth are like super super bad and you do have to get them but i don't think it's an emergency you can always get them when there's more money or when you're an adult because oh now that i've opened the window there's more noise sorry but yeah like i was saying um adult braces are a thing now so it doesn't even have to be when you're a teenager so there's full time to like save up a bit or for you to like wait until you get a job so you don't have to ask your parents or whatever yeah yeah i mean yeah if you if you're really self-conscious about your teeth i would advise you get them if it's like something that really weighs heavy on your spirit then yeah i would suggest you get them but like i said it's not an emergent thing maybe look into like other things you can do first i know that like other options these days is things like invisalign i don't know how much invisalign is or like invisalign type products i don't know how much they are but yeah things like that could definitely be maybe less expensive than traditional braces yeah also my braces were the traditional braces so maybe there's like better technology ones which are cheaper so definitely do some research if you really want them but yeah i definitely would advise you get them my only advice would be to look for an like to do your research about an about the orthodontist you want and like get some reviews from previous patients from previous patients yeah because when i like when i started mine there were very few orthodontists i think it was like one or two so i didn't really have much of a choice but nowadays there are a lot more orthodontists so you don't you're not stuck with one person uh okay so now i'm gonna do the questions that you guys asked me on instagram let me see let me see um how much are they and can one get a payment plan like i've already said um the price has probably changed from when i got mine but when i got them it was 20 something thousand and yes you do get a payment plan you don't pay the entire twenty thousand medical aid pays the entire medical aid pays some of it and you pay some of it it also depends on your medical aid i'm sure some medical there might be a medical aid that pays all of it if you're lucky enough I, i'm not sure you have to check with your individual medical aid if you don't have medical aid then yes you pay all of it but i'm sure yet again it'll be over a span of a few years however long you're supposed to have your braces but also this might depend on the orthodontist that's another thing mine this is how mine is set up but i'd like to think all of them are set up pretty much the same because i don't think anyone is trying to unless you can pay all of it hey but yeah i'm sure they do have payment plans um don't they obstruct you when you're making out <laughs> um no they do not not that i have noticed because yeah but no not to my knowledge maybe they were lying to me but no not to my knowledge it, i mean unless you have like the hooks there was a time i had hooks on the inside to align my teeth like but here 
that definitely like yeah yeah that definitely could hurt because they hurt me but yeah otherwise no not really how do you give moving on <laughs> i hate you guys wow 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 how long have you had braces 10 years and when are they coming off um when you drink tea do you slurp it around or not <sighs> my mother would kill me my mother hates loud eaters and like when you're eating soup now nah. My mother would kill me. So even before braces, I was not allowed to do that. So yeah, no, I don't do it, but it's nothing to do with braces. It's just to do with the fact that my mother does not like that thing in her life, in her spirit. She don't like it, so I don't do it because I wasn't trying to get smacked as a kid. What colors to get? You can literally get whatever color you want. You could even get a combination of colors. I remember there was one of my classmates who got like red, green, and yellow, which was like the Rastafari colors. She did like a ding, 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 ding. Yeah, you can get literally anything. I once got blue and pink. I once got yellow. I once got pink alone. I once got literally anything. But towards the end, like the first few years, the first, the first, no, the last the last few years i would literally just get black or gray whatever was like the least visible because i was tired of it i done every color known to man well that they had so i was just over it it was fine it was enough but yeah you can literally get any you can even get clear the problem with the clear ones and the white ones is they get stained by the food you eat so the white ones if you eat something that has like turmeric or curry they'll be stained yellow this actually happened to my friend they will be stained yellow so yeah literally whatever color you want sometimes they don't have stock that's the only thing that would stop you but otherwise whatever you want um how long have you had your braces for 10 years a whole decade imagine imagine wow can you recommend the clinic you went to no 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 no, I cannot. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, maybe I just personally had a bad experience, but, and maybe they're not terrible, but I personally cannot recommend that place. Yeah, I don't want to say anymore. I did not have a great experience. Maybe others did. Maybe it's your bad thing. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. But yeah, I personally cannot recommend it. So, ah, sorry. Those are all the questions. Those are all the questions. Thank you so much for watching this video. There will be so much more content coming up. Uh, what else did I want to say? Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on my socials. So when I ask questions, when I like do these Q&As, you can ask me a question. Don't forget to like this video if you liked this video. I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to leave a comment on what your favorite part is. Or just if you have any other questions, I will answer them probably in the comments. Uh, what else? Don't forget what other videos you like. Tell me what other videos you'd like to see from me. So yeah, thank you for tuning in. My name is Girly and you have been amazing. And I'm not funny. But yeah. <laughs> I hope to see you in my next on mm, but I can't see you. I hope to see you watching my next video. That was a really blonde moment. So I'm gonna go now. Bye. <laughs>